And here we go from Foxborough. Tom Brady, Patriots, young Mark Sanchez, all his playoff games road. Wes Welker not starting because of the comments he made late in the week related to feet. Meanwhile, Brady, then Jarvis Ellis, Green Ellis, but David Harris picks off the screen. And amazing, how does this happen? Brady, who hadn't been picked off since October 17th, is snuffed by Rex Ryan's defense, David Harris. But the Patriots... The Jets go backwards a couple plays, and Nick Folk right over the top of the upright. No good. So you figured... Blown what? opportunity by the Jets. And you figured they would not have that many opportunities. Meanwhile, Tom Brady, to, well, he's really found his tight ends this year, Tom. Algie Crumpler, rumbling, played a big role in this game. He also made the saving tackle on David Harris on the interception we showed. But Brady for Crumpler here, and could not play the role that he wanted. He dropped it. Yeah, and you see him get open right there. Brady throws a great ball, very accurate. Crumpler just drops it. Field goal, New England, 3-0 Pats. Second quarter, Sanchez buying time. Then to Braylon Edwards down the left sidelines. Jets convert on the third down setup. First and goal, Tommy. You know, something underrated. Sanchez moving well in the pocket, directing traffic, and he literally put the ball right on Braylon Edwards' head. Literally, two plays later, Sanchez to LaDainian Tomlinson. Fresh legs these January games, Tommy. 7-3, to three, the Jets in Foxborough. Now later, second quarter, third and two. Brady looking to Rob Gronkowski behind him. Jets giving him looks he wasn't expecting. Forced to punt. Now. Brady for Gronkowski again with a buck 20 to go in the half. Fourth down. Maybe, maybe they're feeling that we got to try something. And Patrick Chung, the up man, fumbles it. So this surprise is going to go Wang Chung. No good. Turn it over on downs. But Jets got it. You see the direct snap to Chung. Uh, he fumbles the football. No chance for that play to work. So now the Jets with the ball at the 37 and LT up the middle for 16. First down. Later in the drive, third and four from the 15. Sanchez to Edwards. Fighting, fighting into the end zone. Touchdown. 14-3 off the fake punt that went awry. Chung says, my fault. Patriots in trouble. Third quarter. Pats get the ball. The law firm, Ben Jarvis, Green Ellis, stuffed. Jets force a punt. Now, next possession, Brady crushed wow. by Calvin Pace. It's a fumble, but the Patriots somehow at the bottom of the pile fall on it. Fortunate. Patriots very fortunate that Brady didn't get hurt right here. You can see he lands awkwardly, his throwing arm up in the air. Uh, maybe a little discomfort right there. He'd shake it off. Brady to Gronkowski, the rookie, down the seam for 37 yards. Then, 39, New England. Brady to Deion Branch, covered well most of the day by Darrell Rivas. This time Rivas wasn't on him. He breaks the tackle, first down. Brady, Wes Welker, and he hangs on. First and goal, Welker okay. Now, we said Crumpler played a big role. Here we go. That's the Welker play that he hangs on. Before it was Branch. Now it's up to Crumpler and looks tight, but no. Fake the give. And a touchdown to Crumpler. An eight play, 80 yard drive, 14 9. When do you go for two? The last minute of the third quarter, Bill Belichick said, now, Sammy Morris. Yeah, and we've seen that play often only from the New England Patriots. So 14-11. Now Jets. Mark Sanchez. Two rough games in this stadium in his career. Not today. Jericho Contrary. Down the sidelines to the 13. A 58-yard pickup for the Jets, answering the Patriots' score. Third and four from the seven. 
the other side from the Super Bowl catch <laughs> by Santonio Holmes. Of course, he was a stealer then. He was, what a beautiful play for the touchdown. Yeah, and look at him get the toes and the knee down. Looks like the shoulder hits. I don't think this would have been overturned no matter how long they looked at it. 21-11 New York. Now Patriots third and six. Brady, Branch, first down. Later, Danny Woodhead moving forward for a first down. But they're down two scores. Seven and a half. Brady to Welker, first down. Now second and ten. Sean Ellis played an excellent veteran game for the Jets. Puha with the sack. On the sideline, Sanchez saying, there you go, defense. Just over five to go. Fourth to 13. Brady for Branch can't make the catch. And the Patriots turn it over on downs. Just over five. But now the Patriots defense is held in. Instead of a long ball, it's a long punt return. Julian Edelman mm -hmm. spilled after a 41-yard return. Yeah, giving Brady a short field to work with just what the Pats needed. Later in the drive, Brady to Gronkowski. Gain at 12. First down. 2.20 to go. Third and 10. Brady to Welker. Tackled immediately short of the first. So Shane Graham comes out. You're going to need 10. It's a 35-yard attempt. Good. 21 to 14. So you know what's coming. It's the onside kick. It looks like it's a good one, but it squirts back. And instead of falling on it, Antonio Cromartie, whose return, if you will, against the Colts was such a huge play, does it in an interesting fashion. Yeah, this is an outstanding kick by the Patriots. Ball gets lost in traffic when it squirts out. Boy, the smart thing to do, to fall on it, the lucky thing to do, pick it up and run with it. Well, when it's your day, a buck 45 to go second is Sean Green. Look at the Jets running into the end zone. Touchdown! Rex Ryan and the Jets have beaten Peyton Manning and Tom Brady in back-to-back -back weeks in the playoffs. Only happened once ever. The 2002 Tennessee Titans did it. The only time those two have gotten beaten in back-to-back, -back, but the stakes so much higher today. Bill Belichick. Two games at home the last two years in the playoffs, two losses.